Hey guys, welcome back to Suck Wolves, and today we're going to be doing a review of the Realme GT2 Pro. And I hope you guys like this video. Let's do that right now. So, basically, if you guys might be thinking about Realme GT2 Pro, it is an upcoming mobile by Realme and it's currently not um, a rumored. So, the phone is actually uh, it's not rumored to release, and also the phone is rumored to come with a 6.5 1 inch touchscreen with a resolution of 1080 to 1400 pixels with an aspect ratio of 20 is to 9 and it's also uh, expected to be powered by an octa core Qualcomm Snapdragon 888 processor with an 8 GB of RAM. Now you guys might be wondering what it is battery is. So it is battery is 5000 million power battery with drones with Android 12 and that is a bit fascinating because Android it is runs with Android 12 and uh, now it is also with Realme GD Pro, which also supports proprietary fast charging. Now, when we go for the cameras, it's uh, that this packs a triple rear camera setup with a 108 megapixel primary camera and an 8 megapixel with 5 megapixel, and it's also told that it will be having a single front camera setup for selfies and 32 megapixel primary camera. Now we'll be knowing about its Android, as I said earlier, and about its input storage and its connectivity options. Let's do that right now. The Realme GT2 Pro runs and, uh, the Android 12 and the Realme UI 3.0 is based on Android 12 and packs 120 GB of inbuilt storage. Connectivity options on the Realme GT2 Pro are set to include the Wi-Fi Android 2.11, A by B by G by N by C by AX, GPS, Bluetooth 5.1, uh, NFC and USB Type-C. Sensors on the phone include a uh, rumor uh, to include accelerometers, ambulance sensor, gyroscope, proximity sensor and in-display in sensor. And that's all for the review.